It's February 21st, 2023. I'm in Belize, Ambergris, Key Island. And today um, I'm living down south, a little bit uh, further south than um, Mahogany uh, Bay Hilton. And we are going to venture through the city, go further north than I've ever been before. And Kay, uh, I mean, um, Kat here uh, is one of the top muralists in Belize, and she's going to paint another structure. And uh, we're going to sh sh show, show some of them on the trip up. And we're going to have a fantastic day in Belize. So join us, and we'll have some fun today. So I built this little um, bridge. And uh, it works. There you go. And we're, we're off to north. Our first landmark is Mahogany Bay Village Resort and Beach Club. There we go. Happy people all throughout Belize. And we've got people exercising, walking. Looking good. Looking good. And uh, that's the first uh, landmark. One of the first resorts on the island is Victoria House. Quite an elegant place. And there's lots of these bumps that keep you from going too fast, even though golf carts have a governor on them the Escalante estate. Quite a large estate behind big gates. And the neighborhood adjacent to it is and, also called Escalante. And they own the neighborhood. So they're, they're players on the island. And here comes our first fruit stand. I believe this is a fruit stand, no? Oh no, this is a little restaurant. Mother Tree. Mother Tree? Mother Tree. What the hell is that? Okay. Mother Tree. Caribbean chicken. <laughs> place and these little uh, uh, taco stands open up during the day and they serve what uh, about a 50 cent taco which is about two bites but it's pretty tasty. Fruit stand I was referring to earlier. Lots of fruit stands. Lots of fruit. Uh, everything's fairly expensive here. It's an island and everything has to be imported in. What do you know about this place here? What is this? Not a rock. Taught and redone pickleball court. Pickleball court. They have a pickleball court, and we're going to be doing a pickleball event on this Thursday, two two o'clock. So all you Belizeans want to come down, and check out pickleball. We're coming up to what's called Alaya, and it's one of the more pricey places to stay. Around all inclusive, all inclusive seven hundred dollars a night. South Station Bar and Grill. Friends of mine just opened up that, and Alaya is looking. Cool. It's the only all-inclusive? All, 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 all the booze and food you can drink. All-inclusive. Let me get a sign of, shot of it here. There it is, Alaya. Ken Bama? Graham Bama. This is where we're going to build the new adult beach club. Okay. And we're coming into town here, right? This is the first part of town. Well, we got the baker. We got the baker. It's been here 15, 20 years. 20 years running. Great little breakfast. Very popular tourist spot. We've got Super out. My first shopping experience here. We got Bowen. Okay. Dixie Bowen Owens. This, this is where the school used to be. Oh, okay. So it's family owned. He's from the beach and everything else. So Sir Barry Bowen was one of the first players on the island. And we've got Ramon's uh, Village here, which I haven't explored yet, but it's... it's one uh, of the first resorts in Midtown. It's, we're Midtown right now. Victoria House was the first resort south. Yeah, and uh, Ramones is pretty cool. They got their golf carts paint, painted very nicely, which I think uh, everyone should paint their golf carts because they're so ugly. But uh, Ramones is pretty chill. There's some of the carts in the background there. We're coming up on the world. Well, there's a boat show coming up. Bar. February 25th, boat show. I got to go to that. Okay, everybody, so February 25th. This is the most famous bar in town. The most famous bar in town? Yes. And it had a big Super Bowl party. Not and the I most won. popular, the most famous. Uh, not the most popular. Because you watch all the airplanes land. There you go. It's the Runway Bar and Grill. Carlo and Ernie's. Carlo and Ernie's. And this is my buddy Chu, barbecue. He's one of my ambassadors. Here's the uh, airport. A very small airport, but gets it done. All the carts, this uh, Dabari home, we have ambassadors there. Very nice place to buy home furnishings. You have the Remax offices, of course. And we're about ready to hit the um, turnabout, I think it's coming up. The turnabout? Yes, the turnabout? Yes. Well, we're not going to go by the tarmac. We're just going to go in front of the airport. 
Okay. And there's uh, on the way to the. Uh, there. This is welcome to San Pedro. This is like the tour of San Pedro, everyone. This is, we're this is a school behind this. Downtown this is a school behind these walls, right? Yes, it's a school. Okay, you got the big schools going on. And all our billboards are hand painted, as you can see. All the billboards are hand painted. Right. This is our entire billboard central. This is billboard central. Do you want a billboard or advertise this space? I do one what, right there. Be fantastic. All hand painted. How much does it cost? How much? Good question. This is the award winning chocolate boutique. They make all the chocolate by hand. Belize Chocolate Company. And what was this area called? This is downtown San Pedro. This is downtown San Pedro. And you can see there's a few golf carts, you know, everyone there's golf carts. There's delis, there's restaurants. It's like Bourbon Street, basically. Like Bourbon Street. <laughs> Basin Street, Bourbon Street. And if I'm not mistaken, to the right here is our friend's Charlie's place? No? One more block. One, oh, one more block. I was close. You are correct. I was close. We went to his right memorial. Right here on the right. Yeah. Where the big star is. Yeah. That's your San Pedro Town Council. The first annual boat show. i got to find out who was involved in that. San, oh, there's a town hall. Okay, i got to come back here. Meet them. Traffic officer. Plane flying over. This is where Charlie's uh, Estelle's is. Right there, right? Is that Estelle's? And this is, what's this area called here? Central Park. Central Park. And I'm up, I'm up in New York. Here, there's the clock tower. Oh, it looks like they're remodeling it, or painting it, or doing some sort of thing. They had a carnival, which I didn't, I apologize for not recording. But the you're church. getting the church. Roman Catholic. Okay, Roman Catholic Church. which has the tallest palapa on the entire island in there. <laughs> okay, and what is a palapa? Palapa is a symbolization of um, a temple or a gathering place Yeah. where people come together to meet. Okay, and you eat them here. <laughs> and you eat them. No. You said it was a palapa. Yeah. I thought you ate palapas. That's a papusa. Oh, that's a papusa. Oh, my goodness. Oh, so many things to learn. Believe. Like a mean sanctuary. Okay. So it's the tall Palapa. You see a lot of people by foot because it's a small little village. Here's the Western Union. This is where I collect my money. Western Union. There's a few Western Unions. So I'm having a hell of a time deleting files so I could record some more here. But we are going across the bridge. Very Bowen. The Barry, Mary, Barry, Barry Sir Bowen, Barry Bowen, Sir Barry Bowen Bridge, who is uh, basically one of the founders of the island, and uh, this is a new bridge. They just remodeled it. They can have two lanes. Used to only be this wide. Yeah, it only used to be this wide. Now it's that wide. Or that skinny. It used to be this skinny. Now it's that skinny. And okay, they're almost ready to open it up. Will it be a ceremony? Sure. You have to have a ceremony when you open up a new bridge. Martinis. And that, in the background is the Paradise Theater, which uh, I'll be uh, doing a one-man show in soon. It's a one-man comedy about uh, life, love, and the pursuit of happiness. So get your tickets. And here we go. What are they doing down here? cable. Looks like they're building uh, something I, down there. I believe they're putting cable in. Oh. Gucci cable. Yeah, maybe. Anyway, we've crossed the bridge. We are now north, right? Are we, we considered are north? north? We are officially north. And uh, without any much more, there's the Paradise Theater. Get your tickets to uh, Dr. Fantastic's one-man show, Life, Love, and the Pursuit of Happiness. Coming to Paradise. So two things you should know about when you're north. You can drive fairly quickly without a bunch of bumps. And it gets a lot more expensive, right? Oh, Every, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything's more expensive north. And there's... Uh, this island is 25 miles long and one mile wide, and uh, you saw pretty much a lot of it, so we are north, going at a great next speed. What else can you tell us about north? Well, we're coming up on Crocs. Crocs is three, four stories tall, and it's...
It is the ultimate sunset watching spot. Oh. Why haven't we come here before then? Well, I've tried. We've been passed out by then. We've been passed out by then. I've tried. There's Crocs, everybody. The ultimate sunset. This fucker stays packed and never... Swim up bar here. It's mm -hmm. called Pure. Pure. Pure ball. Awesome. Pool bar. That's very nice. Very nice. We gotta come here. Mangrove Bay. And if you travel about another couple of miles. We are coming up to what's known as the worst roads on the island and the most expensive real estate. Is that correct? From my perspective, yes. From her perspective, yes. It's like the lunar moon landing up here. Okay. Valeria. Jam Rock Island Cuisine. Brand new. Because of technical difficulties, I was not able to film the Sunrise Carib or the Grand Carib. These are luxurious high-rise, uh, I guess, condos. Right, condos. Uh, let me just pass a little bit ago. You see the, rough, the road is kind of rough. It's still beautiful. And somebody built a home with no neighbors. They will have some soon, very soon. <laughs> All that's for sale. All this is for sale. Everything's for sale at the right price. So this, if we turn left here, we we'll go to Sunset Beach, or, or I'm sorry, not Sunset Beach, Secret Beach. See there, the Secret Beach water park and all kind of different things. We're holding up traffic. However, we're going to the right. We're going to the right. It's my first. To go north. This is my uh, first time going right to go further north, uh, nosebleed area, and you see the road is kind of a little bumpy, but uh, we'll get there. Beach, uh, what did it say? Club? Hello, fantastic day. Here we go, We're going north. We have reached our destination, La Isla Bonita. Did you paint that? Did you paint that? No. No, you didn't paint that. <laughs> Jeez. This guy used to sell wine, but he's out of business, as you could tell. Wait, you're supposed to do this. Cat will soon transform this normal looking restroom in into shedding. a work of art. The other one I had full sunshine. And this is the one she's already created. She did all these stencils on her own. And it says Senoritas. Really fantastic. Beautiful. And this is the uh, next to the restaurant, which is closed today, is the Whiny Gringo. And they sell uh, cheese and Gourmet foods and all kind of fun stuff. Did you make that? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> I gotta stop asking that question on camera, I guess. Very nice place. Air conditioned. Beautiful. Beautiful goods. Sweet dreams are made of cheese. Who am I to disbree? Disabree. Very nice. Look at this place. And they even have Campbell soup. This town has lots of hot sauces. This is called Beware. This is called uh, something. That's called a horn, red hornet. That's supposed to be the hottest. Lots and lots of different hot sauces. Very, very cool. So this is Caribville, and the sign says population, and the number is happy. So that's pretty cool. So, uh, again, I missed it earlier, but uh, the, the structure on the right there are the high rise condos. And then there's a grand creek as well. This little Creepville. And as you can see, I'm now leaving Creepville, whose population was happy as I mentioned. And that was less than a mile. Long. Hope you enjoyed the tour. This was today's sunrise.